In the world of gaming, the right graphics card can make all the difference. Today, we're unveiling our top picks for the best graphics cards in 2023. Kicking off our list is the powerhouse, the ASUS TUF Gaming RTX 4090 OC, packed with features for the ultimate gaming experience. Featuring NVIDIA's Ada Lovelace streaming multiprocessors, the 4th generation Tensor Cores, and the 3rd generation RT Cores, this card takes performance and energy efficiency to new heights. Experience up to 2 times the AI performance and ray tracing performance. In OC mode, enjoy a boost clock of 2,595 MHz for that extra gaming edge. Efficiency meets cooling. The dual ball bearing Axial Tech fans deliver up to 23% higher airflow, ensuring your system stays cool even during intense gaming sessions. Whether you're into competitive gaming or immersive experiences, the ASUS TUF Gaming RTX 4090 OC stands tall as our top pick for the best overall graphics card in 2023. But wait, there's more. Stay tuned as we reveal our picks for the best GPUs in different budget categories. Get ready to elevate your gaming with the finest graphics cards of 2023. Let the gaming adventure begin. Now, let's dive into the realm of AMD graphics cards. Our top pick for the best AMD GPU in 2023 is the XFX Speedster Merc 310 AMD RX 7900 XTX. Meet the XFX Speedster Merc 310 AMD Radeon RX 7900 XTX Black Gaming Graphics Card, a powerhouse designed for enthusiasts and gamers seeking top-tier performance. This AMD RDNA 3 Beast is armed with impressive specs. A 24GB GDDR6 memory, a 384-bit memory bus, and a remarkable 6144 stream processors make it a force to be reckoned with. The XFX Speedster Merc 310 doesn't hold back on clock speeds. With a base clock of up to 1855 MHz, a game clock reaching up to 2455 MHz, and a boost clock soaring up to 2615 MHz, it's engineered for high-performance gaming. Experience unmatched memory performance with a 20 gigabits per second memory clock, 24 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory, and a memory bandwidth reaching up to 960 gigabytes per second. It's the key to seamless gaming at the highest settings. Keeping things cool is crucial, and the XFX Speedster Merc 310 delivers with its 3-fan thermal solution. Designed with a 2.9-slot card profile, it ensures efficient cooling even during intense gaming sessions. For those who demand nothing but the best from AMD, the XFX Speedster Merc 310 AMD RX 7900 XTX stands as our top choice for the best AMD graphics card in 2023. But the AMD lineup has more to offer. Stay tuned as we reveal our top picks for AMD GPUs across different budget ranges. Elevate your gaming experience with the cutting-edge AMD graphics cards of 2023. The gaming revolution is here. The release of the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4070 series has some great benefits for gamers, delivering performance around 3080 levels at a lower price than that with improved power efficiency, and we're introducing our new MSI GeForce RTX 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig in this episode. Today we'll do some benchmarks in a few games between the RTX 4070 and the 3080, and go over some features of DLSS 3 which are only available on the RTX 40 series cards. New for the RTX 40 series, NVIDIA's Ada Lovelace architecture has new streaming multiprocessors for up to two times the performance and power efficiency. Fourth gen tensor cores do up to four times the performance with DLSS 3, another technical advancement over last gen, and with NVIDIA Reflex, can deliver higher FPS with lower latency. Third gen RT cores give up to two times the performance in ray tracing. The 4070 is based on the AD104 chipset with 5888 CUDA cores. The base clock is 1920 MHz with a boost to 2475, much faster than all three last gen cards. Up from last gen's 3070 with 8GB GDDR6 non X, the RTX 4070 is now at 12GB of GDDR6X, and memory speed goes up to 21 gigabits per second. Both are also higher than the 3080. The board power is just 200 watts for the 4070, which is almost tied for performance with the 3080, a 320 watt card. If you're upgrading, the MSI GeForce RTX 4070 Ventus 3X 12GB 
is a two slot height card measuring 308 millimeters long by 120 wide and 43 high. Power connects with one 8 pin PCIe power connection, so it's a very easy upgrade. If your PC case is shorter, the MSI GeForce RTX 4070 Ventus 2X 12 gig is just 242 long by 125 wide and the same 43 millimeter height and both the Ventus 3X and 2X have OC versions which are tuned for a little boost. For our test bench, we used an Intel i9-12900K on an MSI MAG Z690 Tomahawk Wi-Fi DDR4 with an MSI MEG Core Liquid S360 EIO for cooling. For memory, there's 64 gigs in two sticks of G-Skill DDR4-3600, and the system drive is an MSI Spatium M480 PCIe Gen 4 2TB NVMe M.2 SSD, powered by an MSI MEG AI 1300P power supply. Is the MSI RTX 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig the best value for 1440p gaming? Let's look at some game benchmarks versus an RTX 3080 in Windows 11. Cyberpunk 2077 is a very demanding title at ultra settings, even for higher end RTX 40 series cards. And at 1440p with ray tracing on, the RTX 4070 posts 33 FPS average next to the 3080's 36 FPS. Enabling DLSS 3 on the RTX 4070 sees generated frames pushing 110 FPS versus the 3080's 63 FPS average with last gen DLSS turned on. This is a 3.3 times improvement over just RT and 75% better than last gen DLSS. F122 is a game known for delivering very high FPS with the right settings, but we're taxing it with 1440p ultra settings with ray tracing turned on. Here we're seeing 81 FPS versus the 3080's 70 FPS average for a 16% lead. Turning on DLSS 3 on the 4070 gets 241 FPS average versus 154 FPS for the 3080 with DLSS and its generated frames for a 56% overall boost in frame rate. Last up, we're testing Hogwarts Legacy at 1440p with ray tracing on, and the RTX 4070 posts 63 FPS, just a hair over the 62 FPS average from the 3080. With DLSS 3 enabled on the 4070, it's getting 100 FPS with added frames compared to 88 from the 3080's previous DLSS implementation for a 13.6% boost between DLSS generations. For power consumption, Tech Power Up shows 206 watts for the RTX 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig in gaming, 46% more efficient than the 3070 Ti at 302 watts. And the RTX 3080 10 gig draws 336 watts, so it's 63% more efficient with nearly matching performance. Over the same tier last gen RTX 3070 at 232 watts, it's still 12% less, amazing as it delivers about 40% more performance. Note the minimum recommended power supply should be 550 watts. TechSpot did an analysis of cost per frame for a 13 game average at 1440p, and we're seeing the RTX 4070 at a 599 MSRP to be the best value RTX 40 series card this generation at a price of 476. It beats the 3080, which gets 578, the 3070 Ti with 588, and the same tier last gen 3070 at 520 per value. Let's touch on Deep Learning Super Sampling 3, and the RTX 4070 has an 18 game average of a 1.4 times improvement over the 3080's DLSS, and a 1.8 times gain over the last gen 3070. DLSS uses AI to upscale lower resolution rendered frames, making them appear like native level sharpness, and lower resolutions are easier on the GPU, so games run faster. The anti-aliasing of DLSS tends to be sharper than other methods like TAA or MSAA, which all work to remove jagged edges. AI frame generation inserts predictive frames between rendered frames for smoother, higher frame rates. For the RTX 40 series, after activating DLSS upscaling, turning on frame generation also turns on NVIDIA Reflex, which reduces whole system latency, and there's an additional boost option. Our MSI GeForce RTX 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig has won the Tech Power Ups Editor's Choice Award and a Tweet Town Must Have Award too, 
The RTX 4070 almost matches the performance of the 3080 while being 63% more power efficient according to testing by Tech Power Up with an MSRP of $599. With the lowest cost per frame of the 40 series, it really is the best value for 1440p gaming. And gamers get the latest DLSS 3 support, which sees a good to dramatic boost over last gen DLSS, raising frame rates in game. Whether you grab a 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig or the shorter 4070 Ventus 2X 12 gig, you'll get a graphics card perfect for 1440p gaming. If you're looking to upgrade, jumping to a higher tier 40 series or a 4070 Ventus 3X 12 gig may be a good choice for you. And please visit the MSI website In the realm of mid-range graphics cards, where performance meets value, our top pick for the best $350 to $550 graphics card is the Sapphire Nitro plus AMD Radeon RX 7800 XT. Behold the power of the AMD RDNA 3 architecture with the Sapphire Nitro plus AMD Radeon RX 7800 XT. This gaming graphics card is engineered for exceptional performance within an affordable price range. Let's break down the key specs. With a 5 nanometers GPU and 60 compute units, the RX 7800 XD boasts an impressive 16 gigabytes of GDDR6 memory with a 256-bit memory bus. It's a true powerhouse for your gaming rig. Experience gaming at its best with a boost clock of up to 2,565 MHz and a game clock reaching up to 2,254 MHz. The Sapphire Nitro Plus ensures smooth gameplay and high frame rates. Staying cool under pressure is a priority. The Sapphire Nitro Plus features the Tri-X cooling technology, three fans, and a range of intelligent cooling features to keep your system running optimally. Sapphire's premium features, including dual BIOS, trick software switch, and ARGB lighting, add a touch of sophistication to your gaming setup. Plus, the metal backplate enhances both aesthetics and durability. Powered by AMD RDNA 3 architecture, the RX 7800 XT supports the latest gaming technologies, including AMD Fidelity FX Super Resolution and Microsoft DirectX 12 Ultimate. For gamers seeking an excellent balance of performance and value, the Sapphire Nitro plus AMD Radeon RX 7800 XT is the go-to choice in the $350 to $550 price range. But the mid-range GPU arena has more contenders. Stay tuned as we unveil more top picks catering to different budgets. Upgrade your gaming experience with the best mid-range graphics cards of 2023. The sweet spot between performance and affordability awaits. For gamers on a budget, finding the perfect balance of performance and affordability is crucial. Our top pick for the best budget graphics card is the Oshrock RX 7600 Steel Legend. Introducing the Oshrock RX 7600 Steel Legend a budget-friendly powerhouse that delivers solid gaming performance without breaking the bank. Let's dive into the key specifications. With an AMD Radeon RX 7600 GPU and 8GB of GDDR6 memory on a 128-bit memory bus, the RX 7600 is ready for your gaming adventures. Experience smooth gameplay with a boost clock of up to 2725 MHz and a game clock reaching up to 2320 MHz. The Oshrock RX 7600 ensures a responsive and enjoyable gaming experience. The Oshrock RX 7600 comes with features like Polychrome SYNC for customizable RGB lighting, a triple fan design for efficient cooling, and a stylish metal backplate. It's a budget card that doesn't compromise on aesthetics. Keep your system cool with the 0 dB silent cooling, a striped axial fan, and an ultra-fit heat pipe. The Oshrock RX 7600 ensures your gaming sessions stay cool and quiet. Connectivity is key, and the RX 7600 doesn't disappoint. With 3 DisplayPort 2.1 ports and an HDMI 2.1 port, you have versatile options for your display setup. For budget-conscious gamers looking for a reliable graphics card, the Oshrock RX 7600 Steel Legend is a solid choice. Enjoy quality gaming without breaking the bank. Upgrade your gaming experience without emptying your wallet. Discover the best budget graphics cards of 2023. Affordable gaming is just a card away. If you like the video, please click on the like button, write a comment, 
and subscribe to my channel.